Hi YouTube friends, how are you? I hope you're having a great day so far. So today, it is so exciting. I've gone one, two, where is the box? Many boxes to show you. So we're gonna do a little bit of a different video today. We're gonna do a try on kind of like Sephora sell. So you still have a few days to shop. Uh, so whenever I post this, it's gonna have few more days. So I'm gonna show you the products that I picked up during the sale and I'm gonna do a little bit of a try on first impression. So that's exciting. If you're new here, hey, my name is Angie. I hope to stay and subscribe to my channel for more beauty videos. I'm uploading three times a week and without further ado, let's start. All right guys, so I have a humongous box here. Um, I wasn't planning to shop crazy this time of year. Um, you know, I thought, you know what, let's just do you know three four products and then like whatever like i don't need anything to be honest i really don't need uh but you know i just couldn't hold myself and i feel so guilty about it but at the same time i am so excited to share all these products with you i want to try them so so fast to see what they're all about so to start with um this is a product that i wanted let me put this a bit more because it's annoying okay so one product that i wanted to try for the long time was this Tatcha um, the silk canvas so it is a primer I've never tried it and I have the elf primer so I wanted to see if they're really a dupe I do use the elf one but you know I couldn't like I couldn't buy the full size so I thought you know what let me just try the little one because I have so many primers like to go through so this little one I think is a good deal still you're getting a ton of product in here and you know I'll be able to try it and if I like it then I'll you know purchase the full size so I think this was like 20 something and I am really excited to try this um, you're gonna see in my demo when I put it on it was actually really nice because I did had a primer before that one I did put my Dior um, face and body primer because this is my like my holy girl primer so I put this one before and then I remember that I had this one and I'm like you know what I'm just gonna double prime because why not and then I put it all over my face and it was like all matte and like flawless I loved how this thing looks um looked because it just mattified my skin and I felt like it was like you know like really pore filling and whatnot so I am excited to try this all on its own and I'm excited to wear this makeup to see how it holds up and you know just to see if this um primer is really worth the hype and like the price tag because this is pricey so and the next thing i was able to try on was at uh, this foundation this is by shiseido it is a synchro skin self refreshing foundation so i've heard so many good things about this uh, foundation that i really really wanted to try it on the Sephora website it says it's a weightless foundation that synchronizes with skin and self refreshes non-stop for a just apply look and flawless finish it is a medium a medium coverage and i agree with those claims are you gonna be able to see i applied it with my it's cosmetics um foundation brush and it just gave me a really nice uh you know um even kind of coverage it was like a good medium to full i don't like to cake up my foundation so i just did one pump and i used that for my whole face and that's all i did i didn't want to put out more to try to see if it has more coverage nothing like that i just left it as it was and i am really liking how my face looks like i have to tell you that whenever i put it on it was like gray on my skin i used my i used the sephora app to match myself um i bought this shade which is this shade uh 360 c3 so i used my fenty as a reference and uh, this is what it matched me for um when i put it on it was like gray i hated it and i was like oh yo like why is this so gray i just love yellow foundations so whenever i purchased that foundation i expect it to be yellow because that's what flatters me the most so when i put this one i was like so thrown off uh, but i don't know i think it does self adjust i can see see um, a difference if you guys can see my um, my neck you can't see a difference at all like it looks really nice it looks the same color it like evened out like it's settled on my on my face and it even told out um, I don't know 
I think I like it. Of course, I can say more. Um, I have to try it. I have to wear it. Uh, let me know if you want a full day of uh, wear tests of this foundation. I'll be happy to do it. Or if you just want like a quick update uh, at the end of the month, I could do that as well. So leave me comments below. The next thing I grabbed was this um, Kiss Me at Midnight set for Laneige. I love this one. This is the one I have at my bedside. I love it. I use it every single night. I just feel like it's so moisturizing and your lips just feel so like nourished and nice. Even like uh, for my toddler, I don't know, I put it on his uh, little lips. Sometimes at night they feel so dry and I'm like, okay, let me put this on and he likes it. So I love this one and I wanted to try like these two scents. So this is like a mint chocolate uh, limited edition one. They have it in the bigger size and then sweet candy so I'll be trying this one and I'll let you know what I think the next thing I purchased is this set uh, by Loxy 10 it comes in you know like this separate uh, so you get two things in uh, the little candy uh, wrapper kind of thing so I actually bought these uh, for the holidays I thought I could split it uh, people that I want to give um, you know a little something something for Christmas so I think it was a good deal is $34 and you get like four uh, so there's two products in each so you get like you know eight products in here to try so I thought it was a great deal and I'm not going in any particular order I'm just like grabbing from the box um the next thing I have here is my glow recipe blueberry bounced gentle cleanser so I didn't want to commit to the full size I don't know I thought you know what let me just get the little the little one and see how it I don't works. Know, I have so many cleansers but I don't feel like I've been using my philosophy for the longest time and I wanted to give a new one a try so I wanted to see if I like this one um, so we'll see I'll keep you posted as well if I like it and plus I love Glow Recipe all the products are awesome so far I haven't tried anything that I don't like from them so I'm sure I'm gonna like that but you know I don't want to commit to the full size like that I'll just try the little one for now the next thing I have here is this little guy. I was so excited to try this thing. I, oh, I should have, oh, I forgot I had this in here. I didn't put it on, but I mean, I have um, whatever is fun. So here you get, first of all, this little guy. How adorable is he? I love it. Oh, I didn't tell you the name. This one is a gingerbread bronzed and kissed uh, limited edition bronzer and lipstick set. So I, I just, I love this guy. So I'm actually put it back here. I'm gonna put it uh, for decoration. And then in the inside, you see yeah. this is what it looks like. So pretty, stunning packaging. And I'm a sucker for bronzers. I'm a sucker. Um, so this is what this little guy looks like. Let's give it a little swatch. So, oh, and it smells delicious. So it's a little bit light, but again, always in my skin, um, everything shows up. Oh, and it has a nice sheen to it. Mm. Oh my God, it smells delicious. <sighs> so nice. Anyway, I'm gonna be trying this in an upcoming video. Um, I'm gonna be doing a, you know, all new try on kind of video. So we can try that one. And then the lipstick is this one. I have to admit, I got this one because of the packaging. Is that bad? I know. I, I just couldn't. I couldn't. It says Too Faced here. And then in the inside, it has a little peaches. And I love this shade. Look at this orange. I know, like, full is almost over. But, like, whatever. You can wear orange lipstick whenever you want to. Because, oh, my God. Oh. So cute. I, I love this set. Oh my god. Let's put him here. He's so cute. Isn't he cute? Love him. This is a humongous haul and I am filming everything that I got and I'm feeling so guilty. And I'm like, oh my god, what did I do? Anyways, moving on. I picked up the Huda. Retro Creed palette. Oh my god, you guys. I was so excited to try this one. This is the Mercury Retro Creed by Huda. This is what this guy looks like. I don't know. You're gonna see a clip of me applying this.
would have been starting a clip of me applying this, um, you know, like a quick look. But this is what my eyes look like. Um, I don't know. I'm going to just tell you what the colors I use. I have to use it more to tell you what I think of it, to be quite honest. I can't tell you right now. Like, I don't know if I love it. I don't know. I just have to play with it a little bit more. Uh, but I just gonna insert, like I said, just a clip of me applying it. You're gonna be able to see it on my eyes. But I wanna do a dedicated video for this one. You know, just doing swatches, like full on talking, full on. This is what it looks like. I think that my my eyes look stunning, and like that's all I'm gonna say. So we'll see about that. The next thing I have here. I could not get this thing, you guys. I'm sure every YouTuber um, has gotten this thin. It is like so pretty. It is their Fenty, it is by Fenty Beauty. Everybody was asking for more. This is one of my holy grails. Yep, that drop. Yeah. So I was saying, this is one of my holy grails, um, you know, glosses. I'm not really a gloss person at all. But Fussy is like something really special. I love the scent of this. I'm actually going to do a little uh, swatch video um, using all of these. You're going to be able to see if they show up on my skin tone or not. Or if they're just going to be, you know, just gloss. Um, we're gonna see I'm gonna do like a whole video on these because these are like super hot right now the next thing I got is this little set by Ole Harrison and uh, this is their see your best selfie so it comes with a little eye cream and um, a moisturizer I've heard really good things about this I was most interested about the eye cream to be quite honest the banana eye uh, banana bright eye cream so I'm gonna give this a go and I'll let you know what I think of and then the next product that I'm so excited to try is the ultra repair intense hydration for dry patch skin so this is by first a beauty I actually have this one but I have it um, in the non scented one so I have to give this a sniff because ah oh. Because guys, I got it because it was scented. I know, um, so silly. But I mean, I just thought, you know, let me get the full size, um, like the bigger top. You know, you can, you're not gonna be able to see anything. But what I wanted to say is that this is a super lightweight. I use it every day as my moisturizer. And whenever I use this, sometimes I don't feel like I need even a primer. I mean, I don't really like scented products on my face, to be honest. But that one is just like so like blend and you put it on, it's like so boring. Now that I could use Glow Recipe and like I, I get that sniff of watermelon and the other one pineapple and I'm using all those Glow Recipe like scented like fruity things. I, I don't know. I'm just like into it. So whenever they said this one smelled like cucumber and like watermelon, it smells so, so nice. Super, super light. Nothing too abrasive. I am excited to try this one. Yay! I'm so, I'm so annoyed. I'm sorry. The next thing I got is something that I wanted to try for the longest time. It is the Huda Beauty Tantor Contour and Bronzer Cream. I got it in the shade light. I don't know, I thought this one was gonna be humongous for some reason every time I see YouTubers uh, use it. But whatever, it's a really slick, it's really nice packaging, I like it. You're gonna be able to see on the demo that the shade is perfect. So I got light, not knowing, not sure if this was, this was gonna be good for me. But I liked it because on the website it looked really, you know, like not too warm, not too cool. It was like right in the middle. And I was right about that. It blends out like a dream. A little goes a long way. So I did take just a little bit and it worked perfect. Um, I love that. I love that. Like I love cream products, but this one just blended like a dream. Super, super easy, super fast. I can say enough good things about this one. I am so impressed. I have the milk uh, stick too, but that one I feel like it's a little bit more dry. This one is just like so blendable. You know, you don't want to pile on a lot. So just a go, you know, just do a little bit at a time. If you need more, just build it up, build it up as you go. Uh, but I really like this product. I am so excited I got it. 
The next thing I got is um, repurchase. It is one of these light, little one, you know, travel size from L'Occitane. I said I was going to pick up three of these ones and I did. I picked up three. Um, I just love them. I have them all around the house. I can't live without this lotion anymore since I tried it. Okay, let me have water because this video is already like so long. The next product, you guys. doesn't need any presentation does it jesus christ holy crap i got a pat my grad palette this is the first pat my grad palette i've ever gotten i've never even held it in my hands because every time i went into sephora i just look i i never I don't know it's just like so expensive I couldn't I've never want to touch them whenever I went into the store but this time I was like you know what my birthday is actually coming up real soon so this is my birthday gift for myself <sighs> okay so I went through ton of reviews i love mel thompson and i love uh tara and i just i don't know mel thompson said this was her fave so i trust her i trust her recommendation this one is the mother i didn't even say the name i am so excited does it need any introduction i'm sure you guys know which one this is this one is the mother <laughs> the mothership five this thing is just so heavy swatches are stunning i don't even think i should do any swatches i mean i'm gonna do a video on this of course i have to oh man this is so pricey but it is so luxurious like just look at this packaging oh man i am so excited i can tell you how excited i am I know you're judging. Oh, it's my birthday. Just give me a break. Okay, you guys, the next two products are lips. So I got um, a MAC lip pencil in the shade Sore. I know. Can you believe I've never tried a MAC lip pencil? I don't know. You can see on my demo, I applied it. It's really nice. It's a little bit dry, but I mean, it's nice because it's going to last, right? So I just outlined my lips and then I went ahead and I used this Bite lipstick. This one is in, um, it is part of their astrology, whatever. So they have like a shade uh, for each sign. Uh, so this one is Libra. So surprised. I am so surprised that I like this. You guys can see it is so dark. I'm wearing it on my lips right now, but I don't have anything. The next I product is this one by Ole Harrison. It is their Pore Balance Facial Sauna Scrub. So it says to exfoliate, deeply purifies pores with volcanic sand, green fusion, seed oil, and AHAs. So I actually, me and my husband, we have it in our shower. We have the blue one. I'm sure you guys you know which one I'm talking about. The, the hazelnut, hazelnut, walnut, the walnut one. And we went through one full one. So I thought, you know what, let's try a new one. We'll see how I like this one. We'll see how I like it. Um, let's see if the scrub is like really chunky like the other one because even though that one is chunky I like it though Ooh, it's really okay so let's see I may make a mess but it's okay I want to show you um, okay so those are a little bit finer oh and it's actually warming up on my skin hmm. okay anyway I'm gonna have to try it and see if I like it. Um, I just wanted to try another exfoliator. This one has like the AHAs, whatever. So I wanted to give, you know, a new exfoliator a go. I'm so excited. Hopefully my husband likes it too because he uses that one the most. And then to finish up, you guys, I have my last, which is another skincare product. I got the Laneige Water Bank Hydro Essence Serum. So this is an essence. 
Uh, so I was eyeing the kombucha by Fresh Essence. I was eyeing the Sky too, but I can't afford that. So I was eyeing so many things and I'm like, you know what, let's just go safe. Uh, I've never tried anything a uh, skincare from Laneige, just like the lip thingy. Um, so this one, it comes in a really nice glass bottle. This is what it looks like. I am excited to try this. So this one, it says a lightweight green drink for your skin with cow leaf, water, crest, and beet roof. This essence delivers refreshing, long-lasting hydration. So yeah, this is my last item and I am excited to try it. I'll keep you posted. I'm really into skincare these days. So try it. Alrighty guys, so that was it for today. I hope you enjoyed my haul and my try on. This was like super, super exciting. Oh my God, try new products. These are like my favorite videos to watch right now, Sephora sale uh, videos. I have to like stop because I keep adding things on my card and I don't need anything else. Let me know what you guys pick up for the sale. Did you like any of the products that I show you? Are you picking them up? We still have a few days. I don't know when I'm gonna post this video, but it goes through the 11. I'm sure you're gonna see this video before the sale ends. If you're not subscribed already, don't forget to hit that subscribe button for more beauty videos. Um, and also keep on the lookout for the Fenty lip swatches for the Huda review. I have like so many things that I want to do reviews on. So if you don't want to miss, also, click on that subscribe button so you can see them. And also click on the bell so you get notified whenever I post. Alright guys, I'll see you next. Bye!